I'm going, I'm going next week. I'm going, going to UAE, Saudi, and Bahrain first. And? Then after that, maybe Kuwait and Qatar. Uh, and the, what's the mission? Well, one is the IS for the development that Mosul and Raqqa has been resolved. Um, they'll be running away somewhere. So I must make sure that they don't come to our region. And with the Marawi uh, situation, is is very worrying. So we're getting intel um, link up with uh, the South, uh, with the Middle Eastern people, that, uh, leaders that have been fighting IS all these years. Mm -hmm. And uh, secondly, to see the situation in the in the in the Gulf, um, whether we are in a position to actually help in trying to make sure that uh, people don't divide us. And that one we'll see when I come back. I'll be meeting all the leaders there. It is important for us to also be uh, brought into the loop and understand. Uh, I'm, I'm on a fact-finding situation to find out the true situation. Are there any possibility of them running here, the IS? On IS? Yeah. Yes. So there are four, there are four Malaysians that have already died in Marawi. And in Marawi, you see Saudis, you see Moroccans, you see uh, even Australians and, and foreign fighters there. So the real is the threat is real. I'm not making it up. So what are, what are your discussions supposed to be with the Saudi and uh, UAE and all well, that? I know them very well anyway. Okay. Uh, one, one, I need to have an update and find out the true facts. If Malaysia is to have play of any uh, role at all, we need to know what is the the, the why that is there this crisis with Qatar. And you can only that, do that if you are you you go face to face with them, and we are you meet your friends. Who are you meeting, sir? Sorry. I'm meeting the Crown Prince of Abu Dhabi. Abu Dhabi. Uh, prince Mohammed bin Zayed. I'm meeting the Crown Prince of Saudi. Um, that's King Mohammed, uh, Prince Mohammed Salman. And I'm meeting King Hamad of Bahrain. Oh, 